Hello everyone, Miss Mitty here, and today I'm back with a lot of news, so buckle up because the following will be quite the roller coaster. So unless you live under a rock, you have probably heard about the changes YouTube will be making. Now, how will these changes affect my channel, you may be asking? Well, this change will make me choose between being a family-friendly channel or more of an adult channel. Now, I know our lord and savior, Creekcraft, is marching right on over to the Copa HQ to give them the facts, but even after all that change, is going to be inevitable. Although rules may be more loose, sadly, I don't think our community will be quite the same. As of recording this, YouTube has already claimed two of my videos as kid-friendly. And what's so bad about that? I've always said my channel was PG-13-ish. Well, I'm gonna be straight up with you guys. I have never done YouTube for the sake of money and I never will, but the reality of the situation is if the channel cannot sustain itself, I don't know how much longer it would last. I'm growing up and I know you guys are too. You all have helped me in more ways than I can tell you. I don't want to grow up, but sometimes you have to do things you don't want to do. I know I would pour every hour and cent I have left into the channel, but I think college would be a safer route. The other issue I would be facing as a kid content creator is limitations. There are certain games that I love dearly, but I don't want to spend my whole life bound to just making videos of. For the past year, you guys have seen me try to back away from playing the same games. So instead of looking at this like it's a bad thing, maybe it's just the opportunity I've been waiting for. I know that was all a huge pill to swallow right there, but I told you I was going to be straight up. So now, what does this mean exactly? As I've mentioned growing up, it might just be time for my content to grow as well. I know this is all unbelievably unfair, but sadly I'm not left with many options. But don't worry, young ones. If you miss me, you can visit my Instagram or my TikTok. Links will be in the description. I will try to continue to join more platforms so our big happy family can stay somewhat connected. If you have not noticed already, a lot of my videos have and will disappear in the upcoming weeks. Except for a few because I got your babes. This is so down the road I won't be marked as a kids content creator because I don't know about you but I don't have $40,000 laying around. So I guess that's it. Of course for this specific chapter. I truly want to thank you guys for sticking around, and if you are staying, let's continue this chaos. You guys have changed me for good. Thank you guys for three years of fun, and you know, everything happens for a reason, so this might just be a new opportunity. Thank you for sticking around and watching me grow. I wish you could see me now. But why not? Hello everyone, Miss Mitty here. It's me. The time has come and I have finally done a face reveal. So this has been fun, goodbye. So as much as this is fun, um, I really wish it was obviously under different circumstances because um, well, I mean, if you've been watching the video, then you know why. But I felt that my channel just wouldn't be complete without doing a face reveal if I'm going to potentially lose half my audience. The thing is, nobody knows what's going to happen January 1st. YouTubers don't know. I don't even think YouTube knows. Actually, YouTube probably knows. But literally, it is the Wild West. Nobody knows. For all we know, January 1st is going to come and we're all going to wake up and nothing's going to really change. Or everything's going to change and it's going to be exactly as I fear that might happen. This is the closest I'm going to get to be able to say goodbye face to face in a way to potentially half my audience, but it's okay. So um, I guess I'm going to continue to kind of sum things up for the rest of this video. First off, of course, I would like to say thank you to everyone 
who has watched my videos since day one because I... <laughs> okay, we're gonna get sappy for a few minutes. Wow. I really don't like this. Um, I definitely am a different person and I have you guys to thank for that. Um, when I started my channel, the idea of a face reveal was not even in the question. <laughs> but you guys have given me enough confidence and as I said, I wanted this is the closest I'm going to get to saying goodbye or thank you face to face really. So thank you. And I'm so sorry that it has to go like this. Um I need to stop saying um what am I doing? <laughs> um it took me a long time to even come to the decision. But then obviously we had this announcement that there was some changes coming and at first I didn't think much of it but obviously things have come to a point where I can't ignore it which is what I would do. I would ignore it and I would completely blow it off but I can't because it's affecting mainly what I do. And once again, just saying it face to face, completely unscripted, I don't do YouTube for money, believe me. <laughs> I don't make a lot off of it. Majority of what my setup is, is stuff that I have worked on myself. And I'm proud of it. You know, I'm proud of my channel and that's why I'm honestly okay doing a face reveal at this point. Because I might as well just put a face to it and I'm proud of it. I'm going to try to keep as many videos neutral because I know that that's an option, at least right now it's an option. It's just really scary thinking that I can get in very serious trouble for saying like cool in a video. Like this video I'm not going to mark as, it might honestly get marked as kid friendly and I'm okay with that. But the rest of my videos, uh, yeah. Essentially everything that's gonna happen to the channel is really out of my control. Obviously, if stuff happens, I'm gonna keep you guys updated. Definitely recommend um, joining my Discord server. Literally everything that happens, I immediately notify my Discord server and then the community tab if it's like important enough. <laughs> Obviously if it's something stupid that I'm doing, you still you, you have Discord and yeah I update the most stupidest things on there. But, I mean decisions had to be made. Obviously doing this wasn't an easy decision. Yeah it definitely took us, it wasn't like an immediately like, I need to stop saying like and um. It wasn't an immediate, oh yeah, we're going to change the channel to be not kids friendly or whatever is going on right now. It took a long time to really come to that decision, but it was just the best one that everyone could agree upon. And I've asked multiple people what they think about it, and this is just the easiest decision that also makes sense. Yeah, it is not fair in the slightest, and I am so sorry about that. But I have to keep up with the change in some way, or I don't do YouTube at all. You know, so much for my epic comeback. Like, I had this all planned out. I really want to thank everyone for sticking with my channel and everything for the past three years. It has been amazing and weird and amazing. <laughs> I wouldn't change it really for anything, if I'm being honest. Obviously, we've had our moments, but... You know, we grow and adapt, and that's kind of what's happening here is there's nothing I can do, and there's nothing that a lot of people can do, and I know everyone's like, stop being such a downer, you don't know, stuff can happen, and it totally can, but I want to prepare in case it really is, in a way, goodbye. I don't want to, like, lose contact with you guys, because I know that it may not seem like I notice, but I do notice the ones that return to my videos and leave a sweet comment and it means a lot and it definitely helped me out uh, throughout the years and I thank you guys for that because although it may not seem like a big deal it really was a big deal YouTube you guys gave me a reason and I really needed that so 
thank you i've mentioned that i am starting a tiktok and an instagram and hopefully that'll somewhat keep us connected obviously youtube is like the big where i am but i think i'm gonna probably start moving to different social media apps especially depending on how it is because youtube has gotten to a point where it's almost unfair for some of its creators i already have so many issues like copyright is the wild west with music there literally it's not a fun time to really be a creator i'm gonna be honest and i'm gonna keep trying to make content and i'm not going anywhere i want to make that clear i know a lot of this video it may seem like i'm quitting youtube or i don't know i'm gonna go crazy with language i just want to clarify what i mean by stepping up my content to be like adult-ish or whatever is is not me going completely like cuss every three seconds i no but my content obviously might be in the mm, might be in the slightest way more edgier if that makes sense i say edgier but it's not really gonna change basically my whole outlook on this is i'm just i'm gonna go with the flow <laughs> That is literally all I'm going to do because I have no idea what to expect. I have no idea what's going to happen. And I'm just... I'm just going to go as I get the information, honestly. And hopefully it can get to a point where my channel can adapt <sighs> to not completely suck. So, yeah. Worst comes to worst, though. At least this video came out and I got to say, in a way, face-to-face, -face, um, thank you. And I'm sorry. I think that's it, actually. Yeah, it's crazy. Let's pray to God this video doesn't get corrupted because I will cry. <laughs> I will cry. Thank you guys for watching. It has been a lot. And I'm very sad because it's almost like this journey is finally starting, but in a way it's also closing. Because I mean, this chapter has been closing for a while, but this is not the way that I wanted it to end or to start my next chapter so but i thank you guys it has meant the world to me that you have stuck with me and if you plan to stick around i'm not planning on man manually kicking anyone out if you want to stick around for as long as possible go right ahead I'm, I'm not gonna say anything i really hope this isn't the end i really hope that everything that is going on right now there are so many youtubers that are doing so much to try to stop this and it's amazing um, and let's hope that it works. But in the case, as I've said, that if this truly is potentially the last time, then I'm sorry. I don't want to say goodbye. It's more like a see you later. I mean, I have a TikTok. I have an Instagram. I have Twitter. I have Discord. Go going to keep trying to go to different platforms and Twitch might be in the future. <laughs> Who knows? So, yeah. I don't think it's over yet, it's just we met a slight issue. A slight issue that hopefully won't be there for long. I'll see you guys in the next one. For now, toodles my poodles.